This is the Modular Minute, and this is the Shuffling Clock Multiplier Plus from the 4MS company. Today we're going to discuss the shuffle and slip parameters. These two knobs work in conjunction with one another and are sort of like a traditional swing parameter on a synth, but with a twist. The shuffle knob will determine which beats are affected by the slip knob, which itself determines how far back to push the beat in time, making it late. A certain range of the knob will push only a single beat, moving from the first to the seventh beat, then eventually working by pushing groups of beats. Both of these parameters can be modulated with control voltage to allow for interesting and dynamic changes. One thing to note, the PWM knob controls how wide each output pulse is. A very wide pulse will take up more time between beats, leaving less time to push the pulse back. So shorter PWM settings means more slippage can occur. Follow us for more insight into the world of synthesis and sound design, and big thanks to the 4MS company for helping out with this video.